Namaste everyone and welcome to our calming and soothing bedtime yoga practice. As the day comes to an end and the outside world quiets down, it's a perfect time to turn our awareness inwards and prepare our body and mind for a restful night's sleep. Before we start the practice, I encourage you to set up a cozy and calming space around you. Maybe dim the lights or light a candle or an incense. Grab any props you may need for this practice. I am going to use a block but you can also use a roll blanket or a cushion. Just try to make this practice really comfortable for yourself. And when you are ready, let's begin. So today we will begin from the back. So lay down. Keep your heels close to the hips, hands by your side and allow yourself to fully surrender. Find your entire body completely released on the mat. Let go of any tension. If your mind starts to wander, thinking about what happened today or what might happen tomorrow, bring it back to this present moment. Because there is nowhere else you need to be right now. Begin to bring your awareness, your complete attention to your body, to this moment. A moment to notice the physical body and allow yourself to release any residual tension from any part of the body. Fully surrender, fully relax. Now let's do a quick scan of your body just to see if you're still holding on to any tension in any part of the body. We relax your jaw, your eyebrows, your head, your shoulders, your arms, your hips, knees, ankle, your legs. Just try to fully relax and arrive here. Keeping the eyes closed, notice any sensation. Just take this time to become aware of every small sensation in the body. Now let's begin to deepen the breath Breathing in and out through the nose. Just try to take few deep breaths without any strain. Just breathe in and out. No need to force your breath here. Let it flow. Allow yourself to fully release with each exhale. Ground yourself a little more. And now slowly bend your both knees and hug your both knees in to the chest. Just grab your both knees with your both hands. Maybe just hold it here or gently rock from side to side if that feels good. So it's just about being really mindful with each and every moment. No need to force yourself. If that feels good, maybe bring your forehead close to your knees. 
Just give a nice massage to your entire spine, your back. If you keep your eyes closed, you might be able to turn your awareness a little more inwards to notice these sensations to whatever feels good. And slowly release the head back. Release your both legs down. And then open your hands by the sides. Open the feet this time, mat width apart, or just wider than hips. And then move your both legs to the right and gently to the left. So just moving the knees side to side without lifting the shoulders off the mat. So try to keep the shoulders grounded and just release any tension from the back, from the hips. You might notice some tightness somewhere in your groins or in your hips. So just try to release that. This practice is not about how good your pose looks. It's about how good you feel while doing them. So just gently do what feels good. And slowly coming back to center, bring the feet together this time and move your both knees to the right side. We you move your head to the left side as you're looking over the left shoulder, but see if you can still keep your eyes closed just to feel the sensation and opening in the left side of the body. Use your right hand to push your both knees down on the mat. If your knees are not touching the floor, you can support your knees with a pillow or with a block, whatever you have available. So just find a nice stretch, a nice opening in the left side. Breathe into the space. So it's important that you stay connected with the breath. While you're opening the space, try to keep your awareness in this part of the body and breathe deeply into the space. One more deep breath here. And slowly you will come back to center and moving both knees to the left side and your right hand to the right side. Look over the right shoulder this time. Maybe support your knees with a cushion, with a block or just on the floor, wherever it is. Breathe into the right side as you're creating more space on the right side. Relax the shoulders. Let's take two more deep breaths here. Try to expand with each breath, opening up the chest. Slowly bring the legs back to center. Again, you can release the hands by the sides. This time open the feet half width apart as we are moving in bridge pose from here. Press into the hands as you inhale, lift the hips higher. So go as high as you can, as much as it feels comfortable. Pushing the chest more higher, more forward. Breathe into the space. Maybe lift a little more higher. No need to force, just hold where it feels good. Make sure to breathe deeper, more conscious. Two more breaths here. You can also keep the eyes closed or open the eyes, whatever feels good. But I would recommend you to keep the eyes closed so that you can really internally connect with the body. One more breath here. 
and slowly release drop the hips all the way down let's just stay here for a moment to reset the spine allowing your low back your sacrum to completely go wider on the mat feel that your entire spine is completely lengthened now from here bring your right ankle on the top of your left knee hug the left knee in with your hands hold wherever it feels good if this is uncomfortable then you can keep your left foot down and just place your right hand on your right knee to open the right hip you will gently push the right knee away from you if you can then you will try to hug the left knee in to deeply open the right hip hold wherever it feels good just breathe into the right hip feel the stretch and opening in the right outer hip find your maximum stretch and hold it there once you know your maximum then start rotating your left ankle to release any tension any tightness just make small circles to let go of any stress and let's reverse the direction and slowly release point the right toes forward hold it there and slowly release and release the left foot down and let's switch the legs if you need to maybe move or shake the legs let's switch the legs place the left ankle on the top of the right knee now again choose either keeping the right foot down push the left knee out or hug the right knee in find your maximum the more you hug the right knee in a deeper stretch you will experience in your left outer hip so find where it feels good today finding the maximum and start rotating the right ankle to release any tension any stress and let's reverse and slowly release point the right toes forward hold it here and slowly release and then release the right foot down then slowly release the left foot down as well so both feet down hug both knees in one more time this time bring the head closer to the knee and start rolling on your spine as if you're giving a nice massage to your spine allow the back to round more bring the forehead more closer to the knees keep rolling find the momentum and slowly step forward as you come up in a seated position keep your eyes closed now from here bring your forehead close to your knees maybe rest your forehead on the knees for a moment feel a gentle pressure as you're pressing your head gently on the knees and imagine that you're giving a nice massage to your forehead this time and you can slowly lift the head up and you can gently open the eyes so now we are in a seated position from here let's come sit in simple cross legs from here as you inhale raise your arms up lengthen the spine and as you exhale bend forward so maybe walk the hands more forward to find nice length in the spine option to rest your head all the way down on the floor or if you have a block or a cushion then you will rest your forehead on the block extending the hands forward relax the head as you're finding a gentle pressure you are giving a nice massage to your forehead so breathe and feel this pressure with your eyes closed connect with the breath 
observe how the stretch feels in the body stay mindful and connected with this present moment letting go of all the worries from today one more breath here and slowly as you inhale lift the head up walk the hands back and come back up so now you'll place your both hands behind the hips then press into the hands as you inhale lift the chest up maybe look up option to stay here or press the hands lift the hips up knees down hips higher chest up maybe look up or drop the head back breathe deeply into the chest One more breath and slowly bring the chin into the chest lower the hips and come back up in a seated position let's switch the legs from here so again sitting in sukhasan but just switch the legs let's do one more time inhale arms up exhale forward fold find your maximum use the cushion or the block or maybe lower all the way down so do what makes you feel good comfortable connected breathing into the spine pulling the hips back the more you're walking the hands forward you're creating more space in the spine one more deep breath here and as you inhale slowly lift the head walk back and come back up let's do one more heart opening here press the hands option 2 just lift the chest or lift the hips up breathe one more deep breath and slowly chin into the chest and lower the hips all the way down now from here i would want you to sit in a kneeling position so sitting on the heels knees together if you are not comfortable then you can keep sitting in sukhasan so stay here hands rested on the knees keep your neck straight and then start rolling the neck so move the neck from right to left to so gently make circles to release any tension from the neck so making small gentle circles move from right to left with your eyes closed you can really feel the stretch so if you can keep the eyes closed to feel it to release it more and to observe where do you feel the tightness which part feels more open and that's reverse the direction from left to right this time gentle small circles slowly come back to center bring the chin into the chest gently open the eyes if your eyes were closed and then slowly lift the head as you look up from here coming on the knees in a table top so knees are put apart palms under the shoulders keep the toes tucked under as you inhale shift the weight forward exhale drop the hips back on the heels to stretch the toes inhale forward and back forward and back two more forward and back let's do one more forward and back let's hold it here feel the stretch in the toes ankle push the floor away option to lift the knees up if it doesn't feel good then just stay here knees grounded breathe and 
and slowly lower the knees down and from here come up in a tabletop keep the toes tucked under from here five cat and cow so as you inhale drop the belly lift the head exhale round and contract the back push the floor away inhale up exhale reverse three more inhale up exhale inhale up open the chest exhale one more inhale and exhale reverse inhale back to neutral spine from here place the right hand behind your head as you inhale open the chest to the right exhale twist right elbow towards the left elbow inhale open exhale twist three more inhale open exhale inhale open only use the upper body exhale one more inhale up exhale in now inhale up extend the right hand up reaching up with the right hand and exhale release let's switch the side so left and back inhale open exhale twist inhale open and twist don't open the left hip up and in two more up use your thoracic spine one more up and in now up extend the left hand maybe look up opening the chest and release from here sit all the way down on the toes now see if you can sit on the toes this time now knees together heels together hands rested on the thighs just breathe into the stretch feel the release from the ankle from the feet from the toes if this is too much then you can rest the hands on the floor and just feel the stretch maybe just stay here try this one more breath now to release slowly hands forward down on the mat then you can release the toes and from here sit all the way back from here again lay down on the mat extend the legs forward keeping the legs together interlace the hands over the head and stretch your arms stretch your legs stretch your entire body breathe and as you exhale relax let's do two more times so stretching the entire body inhale breathe into the space you're creating imagine someone is pulling your arms up and pulling your legs down and release and let's do one more stretch stretch the arms stretch the legs breathe and slowly release and relax moving into supta baddha konasana from here so this is a hip opener which is similar to seated butterfly but here we are doing it in the supine position so for that you will bring the soles of the feet together allowing the knees to open to the sides now if you have two pillows or two cushions you can use two cushions or pillows to support your knees like this here i'm using blocks but if you don't have blocks you can use the cushion then you can relax then you can relax lay back allowing the knees to open your feet are together if you don't want to use the cushion you will just allow the gravity to do its work and just open the knees on its own okay so do whatever makes you feel comfortable then bring your left hand on your heart and your right hand on your belly keep the eyes closed relax and release your entire body bringing the awareness back to the breath back to the anchor so that you can reconnect with your mind with the physical body to go beyond letting go of any tension if you still find yourself holding on to any tension just let it all go and melt into this moment staying connected with the breath watch your mind watch if any thoughts comes up just observe whatever those thoughts are without holding on to anything 
allow it to let go become fully present and aware of this moment as we are preparing our mind and our bodies for this restful sleep so take all the space you need and fully relax here into this moment it's time to unwind and let go of whatever you are holding on to just be here completely without any holdings fully become present with this moment just know that the sleep is a gift that you're going to give to yourself that is going to nurture you that is going to give you exactly what you need so you deserve a restful and deep sleep so affirm this in your mind that i'm going to go on this journey with myself for next few hours and this will be the most relaxing and restful journey slow down the breath and stay here for next few minutes or as long as you need thank you very much for joining me in this session wishing you a peaceful and rejuvenating night sleep see you in the next class namaste